Hey, what's going on guys? Techcraft here, Fives Head also is Robert, and today I'm going to be showing you a brand new tutorial video for Minecraft 1.8. Now, you guys are probably wondering, how the heck did I get all of these player heads? And you probably already knew about player heads to begin with, but you may not have known how to get them. Well, today I'm going to show you exactly how to get them for Minecraft 1.8 and above. Now, it's a pretty simple process, but it has changed since 1.7, so I decided that I would make a video showing you guys exactly how to do that. Now, the first things first, and the one thing you're going to need right off the bat is a command block. Now, all you have to do is type in this command so be, feel free to pause the video at any time if you ever want to get the command that I place so press enter and boom you get your command block now let's just place it over here uh, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna type the command in so you got to start off by typing in give and make sure to follow the capitalization as I go and the spacing and everything so you start off by saying give then you type in your username so whichever your username is so my name's username Tyan uh, with an underscore I wish I want to get rid of that underscore so badly but just make sure to type in your own username instead then do another space, type in Minecraft, semicolon or colon, or is it's either a semicolon or colon, it's a colon, it's a colon, I'm sure. And then you type in skull, so that's the item, and then you type in one and three. Ooh, three. You type in one and three, and that's the item identity. Uh, don't worry if you don't know what any of this is. Just make sure you follow this, you know, routine exactly, and you will get your player heads. Now, the next thing you want to do is you want to do that squiggly bracket and make another squiggly bracket as well. And let's go back into it, and we'll type in skull owner. Make sure to have the capitalization correct here. Make sure it's a capital S as well as a capital O. Then do another colon with quotation marks. And now this is where you type in the username of who you want the head to be. So let's say, I don't know, I wanted my own username, for example. So I type in Tyan and the quotation mark and there you have it. Now you have the command that will give you the player head. So all you do now is all you need is a button. So let's type in button and let's get a wooden button. I always love wooden buttons. You place it on the command block and press it and there you go you get Tyan's head now whenever you make a new head or try to get a new head into the game since I've already gotten the Tyan head in the first time if you try to do a new one the game will sort of freeze for a little bit only about a second and then you'll be okay but because I've already gotten this in before it should be okay so let's place this down and there you have it there is how you get player heads and you can type in pretty much any username you wish as long as your username exists so anyways guys I hope you found this tutorial very helpful and useful and if you did be sure to like and don't forget to subscribe Subscribe. Like I say, it's the ultimate combination. Should be sure to do both. And I think that's about it. So, anyways, guys, we'll see you all later. Take care, everybody.